I cannot wait to have a panic attack. Because I have an hour to do my makeup. Yeah, apparently that's not enough. <laughs> How long does it normally take? Two. Two hours? Hello everyone, welcome back to Beauty Break. Today is a very exciting episode because we have YouTube trendsetter Thomas Halbert. He is a trendsetter, not a trend follower. <laughs> Don't know if you heard me, he sets trends. He's also a beauty guru, um, something that we know a lot about, obviously. So much, constantly. So he started a trend that's I followed Blank's makeup tutorial. Basically what we're gonna do today is you're going to do a live tutorial for these people, so you're actually getting some makeup tips today, everyone. Congratulations. Wow. Kind of. We are going to <laughs> attempt to follow along. The rules are that this is totally you just doing a tutorial. Okay and you're not allowed to help us, and we're gonna try to yeah. follow along as best we can. I'm confident. worried about both of you. How worried? Because uh, you don't have confidence in our skills? He watches our show. <laughs> <laughs> so what look are we doing today? So I was in between a half cut crease and a halo eye, because I'm known know for my halo eyes. Don't know what that means. You don't? It's a halo eye. It's like pretty shimmer in the middle of the eyelid. Oh, it's like in the middle part, easy. like yeah. right above your eyeball. Yeah, I feel like a cut well, crease would be too much for you what, Wait, what's a cut crease? It's like a harsh line mm, Okay. that you cut with concealer. Well, I think we should go big and do the cut crease. Halo eyes sounds too yeah, easy. Do we're beauty gurus, Thomas. <laughs> Thomas! Here, look at we're beauty gurus. We even have real mirrors. <laughs> I will say that Thomas asked in advance if he could do his eyebrows before coming because that was gonna impede too much on our tutorial it's time. It's literally take me 30 minutes to do my brows. They take 30 minutes? Mm -hmm. Wow. Sometimes 45 if I'm having a bad day. Oh, wow. I, you know what though, that's commitment and I really respect that. Okay, um, so I think we need to start with face makeup. Do you guys have a primer? No, okay. Um, so, is this a primer? One is of these? these really important? Yes. Yes. So oh, I, I brought, knew a bougie primer for you guys to try. It's by YSL, East St. Laurent. YSL? Is there gold in that? Yep. Oh my gosh, we need to like reverse like, you for you every sure? little pump. You have to vocalize what you're doing because this is a tutorial. So I'm just rubbing on the primer. I start in my T-zone. Okay, <laughs> once you have primer on, you're yep. gonna let it sit for a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and set my eyelids because we're gonna do our eye makeup first because um, what we're doing is colorful and we don't, any fallout that gets on our cheeks, we can just wipe away later. A good, yeah. smart plan. Um, typically, I don't do my eye makeup first because I like to be edgy. I feel like you could have used that primer as a hand lotion. I so know. Soft. It's so <laughs> soft, literally the best $50 I spent in my oh life. $50 my. for that. Wow. So here I have a concealer. I'm gonna be, today I'm gonna be using my Makeup <laughs> Revolution concealer. It's the Define and Conceal Concealer. <laughs> Um, I have three different shades, and I'm gonna be using the lightest shade of C2. I thought you were using three different shades. I was like, you have to use three different kinds of oh, concealer. No. So this is my, I wanna do what you did. You were like, this is my Revolution concealer. I'm gonna put it on under my eyes. I'm just, I feel like we should have gotten Or on my eyes, sorry. Why are we putting it on top? I usually put it under. So basically why we're doing concealer on the lids is it's gonna be the primer. It's going to cancel any darkness, any sort of, basically what you do for the under eyes, we're putting under or on top of our lids, just so we can cancel out any darkness that's on, I've already said that. It's basically a primer. Okay, the so the cut crease doesn't get effed up. Yeah. Right, okay. And it on. doesn't look messy or muddy or like ugly. But this is still like, we're allowed to apply it with our fingers. Yep. Because I do everything with makeup. Makeup is but. always, the thing about makeup is like it's really sub subjective to the person. So if mm. you're the type of person that likes to apply makeup with your fingers, then go off do this. You. Do you. You hear that, audience? Live your best life. Wait, it's not start. hygienic. Oh. <laughs> Next, I'm going to set my eye part, the uh, concealer on my eyes. Oh, you and set prep it, it. Yep, okay, set and it forget and, it. And forget it, just so. Scrub any of these? Like a crock pot, which killed everyone on This Is Us. Don't wanna talk about it! <laughs> Spoiler alert. Okay, I gotta do a pony, because like the hair is Jocelyn, just. I don't think you're following the tutorial and setting your. Oh yeah, I need to, I'm getting too distracted. All right, so what is this? This is already two steps is that this, I've never Do I use this? Or? Yeah, you can use that. You're just gonna, like you can use the translucent powder, you can use. This. Oh my god, don't use that word. <laughs> it's red. Wait, use. Um... I thought it was just already the color. <laughs> yeah, like it was oh, just it's like dyed from the cut creasing. Oh crap. <laughs> Wait, I want to interrupt this tutorial really fast. I know I'm not supposed to be asking questions and breaking my own rules, but it feels like you put a lot of powder on. I did. Why so much? Um, because I want the eyeshadow to have something smooth to. Um, like smooth. So skip, on. so I feel like I need. Like it doesn't skip or have any tug a good on base. it. Oh. Yeah. 
What's next? We're gonna be taking eyeshadow. <laughs> And today I'm gonna to be using the Morphe and Jaclyn Hill palette. Ooh, she's really beautiful. I saw There's her in person like recently so and I was like, are you a real person? So you first wanna set down a transition shade and you wanna take a fluffy brush, something All like right. this. Fluffy, and, great. Um, <laughs> fluffy. Then you wanna dip into, which one do I wanna dip on? <laughs> this one. Ooh. This is our transitional shade. Yes, yeah, so a transition shade is basically um, a transition shade. Okay, yeah. The reason why we're doing a light shade, we always want to start with a light shade first. The lighter you go, like you want to start light and then dark, because if you start dark, then it's going to obviously not work. Okay, so once we have okay. that down. Oh, sorry. That's okay. So, that's actually really good. Is it? That's actually really good. Sam, you, wow. Stop, are you serious? <laughs> Do you understand it's like one of Lily's goals this year to learn how to do eyeshadow? You have a nice eye shape. <laughs> do we? Do they have names? Yeah, but I lost the sheet because it just was. It fell we out. definitely lost yeah. our sheet I, too. Okay, so where does this go? This goes just a little bit lower than the color that you previously applied. I feel like so you this just want to be dark and really aggressive. Mm -hmm. I'm go up first. So you just want to like. You want to start patting oh, it? Oh, patting it. Which is very delicate. Patting it delicately. What's the goal of this? Like, does this make your eyes look different, smaller, bigger? The goal, the reason for doing it is always, you know, up in the air. I just do it for a picture. <laughs> I like your honesty. <laughs> you just take it then, do you, like, when you do a full look, how long do you keep it on afterwards? Um, 20 minutes. And then you wash your face or yep. what? So you didn't go all the way down to, like, the lash line? Nope. Same. See, I have like a small amount. I just feel like I have very small lids and the brush is very large. I look like I'm joining Cirque du Soleil. It's actually pretty, but that's not what we're doing today. I, oh no, <laughs> oh no, it's taking a turn. Why are you I'm actually, I don't know. I'm actually trying, which yours looks pretty good. He is Yours looks significantly better. <laughs> I just don't feel like my lids are that big. It's hard to, oh, it's too much. You don't have to have big eyelids. It's a cut crease, you don't have to. You can, I mean, for you, I do have a cut crease, or don't no. I? I you don't. You have a smoky eye right now. All right. Okay, well, that's what I'm going for then. It's that little side angle region. We are going to the outer V, and we're just going to wiggle it in the crease just a little bit. How are we doing? We're doing great. Okay, concealer. I know you're doing great. How are we doing? Oh. Now we take concealer. <laughs> Close your eyes. Yours looks amazing. Stop! Yours looks what? amazing. I'm a booty gorilla! <laughs> So now we're gonna cut the inner corner All of right. our eye. Oh. Need a new brush, um, Lily. Crap. So where's find the, a new brush. Where's the concealer? The crease cutter yes. brushes. Um, okay, so you put it in the eyelid region oh. and then. You wanna have a sharp line right under here. So you're covering up everything you just did. No! Yes, ma'am. That seems. And you just wanna stop right <laughs> Not here. Right. Above. Stop in the middle ridge. Yeah. This is how people do this? So when I see people with this kind of look, yep. I had no idea. Close yeah. your eyes. That's cute. You're doing it. I'll take cute. That's it was cute. like it was like a sad cute, but I'll tell. Oh, did I really f it up? I did. Jocelyn. No! You're doing so well. I actually That's was how trying. It always goes with Jocelyn. It no, starts literally. in the right direction, and then somewhere it's just Something like what goes. Have you, done? <laughs> you know how mine's sharp? What part? Like the the, the concealer, line? Yeah, the line's sharp. Oh, is that how it's supposed to be? I can yeah. just add more. Maybe I wasn't explaining it because I was too busy focusing. Oh, okay, so I'm just redrawing a line. Just above your actual crease. <laughs> and you're supposed to stop midway and it's supposed to stop right where your iris oh, is. Oh, okay. Oh, I have these cute little glitter things from ColourPop. Oh, I love ColourPop. And these are actual eyeshadows? Yeah, they're glitter Fun. eyeshadows. So you just want to put the glitter where you put the concealer. Oh, a lot. I was like trying to spread it out. You're actually doing it pretty right for a beginner. You're doing it pretty well. I'll take it. I'll take it. Right. Oh, but I feel like I wasn't How does my that look? And honestly, you look like I... you're going to Coachella. That's cool. I'm into that. <laughs> but like you've been there for four days already. <laughs> I feel like I blended too much. My crease is not cut. It looks great. I would like to chime in and tell everyone that we've been doing this for over a half hour. Videos might be only 10 minutes, but these tutorials take a long time. We're definitely not doing a full face today, ladies. This is insane. So let's move on to makeup. Like face makeup. Okay. So we don't do like that much. Okay, great. That's kind of a lot of makeup. Yep. I'm so curious about this process. Do you yeah. have a foundation brush or do you use a beauty blender or what? Use a beauty blender. Okay, so you just dab away. Yep. 
You can slowly see my face get cakier and cakier. Okay, I have a question. Tell me a secret about the beauty guru world. We're like, all bitches. <laughs> I have this a is lot. the most foundation I think I've ever worn. Let me see you, Lil. Oh, where'd you go? <laughs> So we're gonna conceal everywhere. Okay. Oh, I feel like I thought you were just supposed to do it like under your eyes and stuff. Oh, well, in this house we're drag queens. Oh god. Oh, I okay. Yes. And this is a lot of makeup. Granted, this is a. It, but this is a daytime look. It's subtle. For Coachella. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, if you're trying to, you know, sweat off your makeup, this will stay in place. Where did you put everything? Everywhere. Chin, jawline, above the mouth, labial like labial a, folds. Lab. I. I think that's. That's the vagina. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I always think the beauty blenders are eating a lot of makeup. Do they, they eat are. a lot of your makeup? They're supposed to make it less cakey, but honestly, you know. It's probably, but the foundation companies are making these so that they can force us to buy more makeup. It's totally a makeup conspiracy theory. You are Ooh, that would be a good episode. How makeup much coffee conspiracy. Did you drink? <laughs> a pot. Oh okay, gosh. so before we get to blending the under eye concealer, did you already blend? Oh, did I move too oh. fast? Before the okay. under, okay. Right. I'll add more. I'll add more. Okay, that's fine. Before we blend out the under eye concealer, we want to prep our powder because we put on a lot of concealer, which will obviously <coughs> right. crease, especially because I have very creasy under eyes. I so I want to well. prep. This is my favorite powder, which is the Maybelline Fit Me. Baking a, is that what we're doing? Yes, like a lesser version. Like a mini bake. Like a mini bake. Okay, you know how like it was strobing, then it was contour, whatever, all those things. What's like the trend right now? I think they've all like kind of like melted into one. E into one another, and they all kind of like are the same. Question, are you blending right now, or, or did you put powder on your? I'm blending. Oh, so, so you're blending, blend. but you're pre you have to get your but that's powder what, prepared. Okay. okay. And then, before it creases, <laughs> before it creases, I'm going to pack powder under my oh, eye. Oh no! Don't let it crease, Lil. I've screwed up the, oh. All right, what are you using to apply that, this? A beauty sponge, because the beauty sponge really melts the powder into oh, the skin. Oh my gosh, how do you breathe? And then I do it on my nose. My face feels very like. That's good. I'm going to take my pressed powder, my face powder, and we're going to powder our faces great. with face powder, or you can use translucent powder. powder. Okay, great. Yeah. I'll just use that, just everywhere. Yeah, just really pack that on. Because oh this gives gosh. you like a very. This just feels. That's like... a lot. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like a lot. I feel like I'm suffocating. We're just going to dig into this shade right here in the Jaclyn Hill oh, palette. That's our original color we started with, right? Yes, because we're going to finish so. up the eyes real fast. Ooh! What? Oh God, what's going on? What is this called? Smoking just out under, the under. Smoking, the lower smoking lash out line. the under part. The, the lower lash line. So now that that's done, we finished up the eyes. <laughs> Ready to hit up an estate sale. Okay, so here you, we're not using that trash garbage. Oh, oh, shade has been thrown. Wait, do you not like the KKW product? This is awful, everyone. It I, is? We don't know this, anything about makeup, so we review you like this? Well, no, 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 this is the thing, is we like sure. review and test these, and we're like, this seems great, but we have no idea. I mean, it looks, what's wrong with it? You're showing us that as if we know what that means. Do you see how powdery and glittery that is? Is that dope? You can't even see it either. So we're using. Oh, Anastasia. Knows you guys where are gonna use at. Anastasia. Mm -hmm. Great. And I'm gonna use my fave, as you can tell. So what was that? Kat Von D. Kat Von D. Oh, Kat Von D. What an icon. She's well Ooh. loved. Honestly, it just depends on. You have a lot of makeup on. <laughs> <laughs> you almost look like Casper. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's my favorite ghost. Slowly use, do circular motions and blend it upwards. Oh. And Journey. then I don't like to contour my nose, so I like to do a little bit of. Pan it up a Just little. Just a little. A little bit of something, something on there. How did you learn how to do makeup? The first YouTuber I ever watched, beauty wise, was Michelle Phan, of course. Oh my gosh, where Michelle is she? She's being a mogul. She's like. She's you, the sweetest. Person. And it's so crazy because like Michelle Phan is the reason why any beauty guru has a career. Um, I'm jealous of her because she was in a Dr Pepper commercial. She was. So is Bethany Moda. Ooh. Ooh, that's a cuteness. What is that? I like this the is. Is that tart? We love tart. The tart big blush book three. They have three. This is the third one. Cute. And they have amazing blushes. Is there like a certain blush color you shouldn't wear? Because I feel like I'm like, oh, I could wear any color. Can you just do it like It just matter? depends. Yeah, just do like. Wait. Ooh, maybe too much. I can't tell. The blush brings it together. And now we're going to do my favorite part, which is. What's this? Highlighting. Ooh, Ooh, fun. I literally have three of the same brush because I love this brush so much. I feel like we're like. This is the Morphe <laughs> like brush. Like, Put your hand in. Five, one, one. Morphe. Morphe. So, How much? Morphe. Really, just want to just dig in. Just do it. 
Okay. And then we don't tap that one. <laughs> okay. We oh we don't tap off oh. highlight. Oh we don't? Yeah. Why? Put it up. Because we want that on there. Okay. All right. And we just want to like. Your facials I know. are absolutely beautiful, by the way. I feel like I have to copy them. <laughs> I can't wait to take so many Instagram That's photos, so... you guys. <laughs> do you like it? What are you going to say? <laughs> oh, I need to... <laughs> and then I like to blend the, the highlight and with the blush and just stuff. So, I just like... so now we're going to go into... We're going to set the face. Is this actually important to do? I yes, because like... it... Is it hairspray you feel, or? You feel how your face so, feels? It feels very tight. Yeah, so this will fix it. Oh, it will! Is, yeah. is there anything in it that was just water? And then but I'm gonna... I love this one because, well, listen, listen, listen. Ooh, I'm telling you, soothing. when are we doing an ASMR? And you just kind of spray it everywhere? Yeah. Ooh, it smells great. I feel like I have to do this while it. <laughs> oh, it feels so much better to have this on my face. Mm -hmm. Very refreshing. I think you just want to do one of these moments. Like you, you it feels like when you're at an amusement park and they have those misters when it's really hot. Or like Palm yeah. Springs. So we're gonna be doing nude lips. Great, I love nude lips. We're gonna overline the lips too. Oh, I love that. Oh wow. Are we using? Oh, so we put it over it top. Are we over? Are you out? Huh? Okay, well. It's such a clean line. Wow! Mm -hmm. You know what I look like from Mos Monsters Universe, not Monsters Inc. When he had his face sucked, because I don't have any lashes on, so I kind of look like I'm bald. Oh no! I just ru literally ruined this whole entire look right now. Prune. So trendy. Very sexual. I loved it. And I will say, I think this is milestone episode. This is like the longest beauty break we've For ever sure. Filmed. Aside from the 100 layers of clothes challenge. Of what, that was also a journey. That was I, an outlier. I think that's what happens when you're like actually like doing legitimate things. <laughs> Following instructions and, and learning. Yeah. Thank you Did for you coming. guys actually learn something? I don't I remember anything. Honestly, but. cut crease. Didn't even have a clue. With, I still don't really know what it is, but I'm on a journey to you get know, there. Jocelyn, if you are facing that way and I can't see the glitter, your eyes look great. If it's Thank just you. like, I'll if take it's it. like, we'll take profile shots. If you can cover up everything except that part, <laughs> yeah. it's gorgeous. Your highlight look at that great. cheek right there. Perfect. Okay, you guys, be sure to head over to Thomas's channel, subscribe, because again, he's a trendsetter. And just a beauty guru. 100%. Mm -hmm. And if you're one of Thomas's fans and you just happen to stumble upon this little channel, well, First I have of to all, say, Vilkomen. That's and German, that means welcome. Then welcome. Um, subscribe to our channel so we can keep working and doing magical things like this. <laughs> Probably not makeup tutorials, but other stuff. Thanks, bye. bye. Click left to watch us try out Korean skin products on Beauty Break or click right to watch us try out an air fryer versus a deep fryer on cheat day.